temperature. Dump in a pretty good amount of oil. I usually go with the pure canola oil. Lay in and we'll do a dozen wings at a time. These are still a little bit too cold in my opinion. I'd rather not do them like this. And usually it's smart to dry them out a little bit too. Okay, I usually like to turn these after a few minutes. Transition them here, you don't want to put them in a plastic container to mix sauce on them in a melter container. To make the sauces, I usually take about a tablespoon or so. And it's more than a tablespoon. A tablespoon of butter. We're going to use about half a cup, maybe? Close to half a cup. I don't really want to use a full half cup because I won't have any left. Okay, now we take the sauce, we pour it on. Shake these up here in a little bit. Got something special in the mail for Christmas. What do we have here? That's right. Some of that sauce on to the wings. If it wasn't twenty dollars a bottle, I'd probably dump the whole bottle onto these. But at that price, we can spread it out over a couple batches of wings. Okay, so we'll be eating wings soon. Hey there, it's Steve O. Smitty. Son Aaron's joining me for some wings. Dave's Insanity Ghost Sauce or Dave's Gourmet Ghost Pepper Sauce. Aaron, why don't you give a read on some of those ingredients there? Right, it has ghost pepper, naga jalokia, hot pepper extract, salt, roasted garlic, acetic acid, vegetable soybean oil, xanthan gum for a thickener. Okay. Uh, the extract is what helps make this hotter. That's the difference. This will taste like extract to a certain extent. I know it does. Triple X. Triple X has three types of pepper X. Why don't you go ahead and give a read on the ingredients if you can spot them there. Okay, it has uh, pepper X, chocolate pepper X, peach pepper X, distilled vinegar, ginger root, turmeric, Turmeric or something yeah, like 
turmeric, turmeric, uh, coriander, cumin, and dry mustard. Okay. So, all flavors that I like. I knew I could smell ginger in there when I was cooking the sauce down a little bit. You could smell the ginger. I almost said it smelled like pumpkin spice. Okay, so, in this one, looks like we have triple X. In this one, looks like we have the ghost. We're going to give them a shake and get these things mixed up good. Oh, yeah, nice and nice and sauced. I don't know if you can see in there. Sauced up perfect. Just a couple comments. My daughter-in-law, Rachel, got me this nice little stand so that I could display my sauces with some respect. We have the lights back there. Jonathan got me those to go with this. Uh, the wife got me some of the, bought me this for Christmas. Aaron's been able to hang out with me and do some of these challenges before he heads back to college. So let's start with the one that's supposed to be 800. Pepper X is supposed to be uh, hotter than the Carolina Reaper. It just hasn't gone through the Guinness Book of World Records thing yet. So let's start out with the Dave's Ghost Pepper. Right, I'm out of my mind. Please leave a message. So, say quick prayers. Come, Lord Jesus, be our guest. Let these yes, gifts to us be blessed. Amen. Well, give thanks unto the Lord, for He is good, for His mercy endureth forever. Amen. So, here we go. Dave's ghost pepper sauce with some pepper extract. What do you think? Good. Good. Instantly got to go. It's probably the hottest thing he's ever eaten. More than likely, yeah. <laughs> Man, don't. Yeah, you have to hurt yourself. Alright. This is a challenge you said? No, it's just stupid. Oh, cool. Because that's how we roll. You said the next ones are worse? Oh, yeah. Yep. They should be. Ghost peppers, uh. One of the hotter peppers. I've seen this ranked at about 800,000. Carolina Reaper. 1.6 million. These peppers are hotter than that. Then again, it's been watered down a bit with ginger and whatnot. Yeah. <coughs> Maybe we'll rent a glass of water. Be right back. You might want to get milk instead. All right. That water just spreads that stuff out. It's starting to retreat a little bit. My stomach doesn't like that extract though. Nick. The beginning of initially isn't so bad. Once you start, start the stop, then it... Yeah. It really goes on the attack. So you get the greasy chicken taste, that's good. Mixed in with the, it kind of offsets that extract. Those are hot. And we'll be so overcome by the taste here. 
so impressed by the taste we don't even notice the heat on the next ones. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm gonna do the next ones now, geez. Ugh, something got in my eye. That's bad. You can definitely feel the sweat just filling up in my hair. Tears are plenty. Mostly it's tongue burn now. Filling in the stomach a little bit. Give that to that idiot neighbor's dog. He's sitting there howling last night. Let him choke on them choking bones. Subsiding pretty good. Probably down to about a three. Oh, let me give these a try. I'll let you know how it goes. So that's all you. First one out, not bad. I don't know if I like the flavor or not. A lot of people like the flavor. The ginger is messing with me. Ugh. All right. Oh, some sauce got up in there. It's not affecting me like the days did. Not at all. Read some of the information off that triple X. I know this right. is like the last dab. It's the newest last dab on that, uh, uh, what's that show? He's a guy that interviews celebrities. I watch it all the time, but like, hot ones. I think this is a uh, something about feast. Yeah, first we feast. First we feast. Bear in mind that the previously hottest thing I've eaten so far <coughs> is a blazing thing in Buffalo Wild Wings. So. Oh! <laughs> Welcome to manhood, son. Yeah. I guess my tolerance isn't quite built up that far. Mostly tongue burn. Not much in the throat. Right now I'm sitting maybe a two. I'm not even gonna bring my. This is the child formerly known as youngest. Eight years later, we had our youngest. Um, I'm not gonna bring him into this. I don't think. We need a non chili head's opinion of it because the other one's gonna melt his face. And he's a handsome, dashing young lad. We don't need him to have any damage. <laughs> it's hard to really compare when you eat them back to back like this because I started out hot. Trying to build a little bit. Well, one thing is for sure, this is how you build tolerance. Take it further than you did. But you definitely yeah. were. <laughs> you were a lot further than you ever have. I took a, took a bungee jump up there. Oh yeah. You kind of leaped past several levels of, we should probably be building you up. No, that's true. I made it. Mm -hmm. I'm alive. Ginger fan is just creeping me out though. I think Warsaw could have done to is put cilantro in it. Buy a weed. Oh, my hair is just soaking wet. See, when you have to sit there and start thinking about should I do any more, it's probably time to quit. <laughs> yeah. I mean, there's only three more rings, so... Um, <laughs> I ain't got a tooth bucket here, so... You might be your lap, buddy. Okay. Johnny Scoville's motto is, it's worth doing, it's worth overdoing. <laughs> Dude will sit there and drink stuff out of these bottles like they're nothing. He's built his tongue way up.
Probably creeping up to a five. I, the breathing's a little, a little quicker, heavier. A lot more pain on the tongue. Still nothing within the throat. No ear ringing or anything like that. Let's see if we can't make that happen. Squash bugs. See already, I'm finding I'm planting peppers. I guess these squash bugs out in my garden. Now we got one climbing up the tripod. You're supposed to have been dead. I'm telling you, I've dumped gasoline on them things. They run around like it's some kind of barbecue. Sure, they went. I went. I lit it up. They're sitting there. Warming themselves by the fire. I'm like, I sprayed insecticide directly on them. If I could, I'd get a little dropper and force feed it to them, but I think they'd get, just get stoned and then keep going. It's like, so I can't grow cucumbers, I can't grow squash, I can't grow anything because once they get going, once they get done with all the food they like, then they go to the other stuff just to make you have a rotten day. Pepper plants. My pepper plants, my hot pepper plants are getting cowed down by rabbits and squash bugs. If you see them squash bugs, or see those squash bugs, they look like a type of stink bug, they're brown, squish them. They have some kind of blue blood, so I'm pretty sure they're alien. That's what they said to hot pepper plants. Mm -hmm. I ate all of the triple X wings. I think a half a dozen pills, might as well finish those up too. <laughs> this is at more heat. That's weird. I wouldn't expect the days to be hotter than the triple X, but it I'm starting to ramp up now that I'm eating these even more than I was. So, Aaron got half a dozen of the ghost pepper sauce. Dave's gourmet. I had probably eight of those. At least 13. Excuse me. At least 13 with the triple X. I'd say I maxed out at a five. The one that cheated. By putting extract, you see it. I mean, I'm taking it. It went way up after I ate this. These extra last two wings. <laughs> so what can I say? They cheat. They put extract in there, and it makes it hotter. Good sauce. I like to see hotter of the uh, triple X, honestly. Normally there's five minute afterburn after these kind of things. Oh, the breathing picked back up. <laughs> Pain in the mouth went what, several levels back up. Because this is the reason why I was eating this is mellowing out to about a two. It's been climbing and it just kind of started mellowing out. Because I got used to it. But putting that daze back, putting it back up to a five. Alright, five minute afterburn. We're going to go ahead and call it good. Thanks so much, Aaron. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. I don't know how why I do this to my kids, but. Appreciate you taking it on and joining me for this. It was a wonderful feast. Look forward to putting some more sauces on wings. 
between the stuff I got for Christmas and the things that some of my kids got for Christmas that they want to maybe do a video on, do some reviews, we got a, we got some videos to make. So. Everybody take care. God bless. Steve Smitty. And... You got a name? No. Alright. And that kid. The child formerly known as youngest. <laughs> Aaron. Signing out. Take care. Why was that hot?